Look at this brownie. It's so decadent, moist, fudgy, gooey. Oh, this is everything you could possibly want in a brownie. It's a one bowl recipe. Gets ready in just a few minutes. So let's get started. Crack one egg in a bowl. Add half a cup of sugar. You can add brown sugar too. It will make it even more fudgy. Take a whisk and whisk it until it's thick and pale. It's been three to four minutes and now it's the time to stop. One thing which I forgot to tell you in the beginning is all your ingredients should be in the room temperature even your egg. Now here I've taken dark chocolate which is in room temperature. It is three ounces which is 85 grams and three tablespoons of salted butter. The Amul one which we all have at our home. Microwave the two just for 30 seconds and start mixing it. Now just in case if you're taking the unsalted butter then add one fourth teaspoon of salt. Now it's been a minute or so and you can see how the mixture has turned shiny, thick and glossy. Time to add the warm chocolatey mixture into the egg. It's one of the best brownies I've ever made. You love the flavor and the texture. Time to whisk it again until it turns thick, shiny and glossy again. Always remember that, that the brownie mixture is always a little thick. Now our little brownies need some flavoring so it's the time to add some flavor. I'm taking vanilla extract. This is the pure one, half a teaspoon. You can also use vanilla essence if you wish to. Just remember it will compromise the flavor. Now we'll incorporate one fourth cup of flour. Switch to spatula and start folding it in. Be gentle while folding the batter. The batter is going to be a little thicker than the cake batters which we make. Now if you want you can stop here. But I'll add some more texture to my brownies. So I'll be adding chopped uh, dark chocolate. You can also add chocolate chips if you wish. To prepare the brownies, I'm using my loaf pan tin. I have used butter paper and now I'm going to sprinkle some chocolate chips on top. You can see the chocolate chips topping. It's looking so beautiful already. Now it's the time to bake. Let's preheat the oven to 180 degrees centigrade. And bake these little babies for 20 to 25 minutes until a skewer inserted comes out a little gooey. Just like the metal skewer shown in the picture. My brownies got ready in 18 minutes. Let's see how they turned out. Aren't these adorable? Let me tell you, you're going to love the flavor and the texture. They are so rich, moist, dense, gooey, almost the texture of a fudge. Hope you're going to bake them soon and tell me how they turned out. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe my channel if you want to watch more.